Hello YouTube, uh, today I'm going to show you just how fast the Barnes & Noble Nook Color is running Android 2.3.7 at 1.2 GHz. Uh, as you can probably tell by the timer, it took 43.6 seconds to turn on. So uh, it's a slide to unlock, you just swipe anywhere on the screen. And um, I'll show you, I'm going to put settings, about tablet. And it is running Android 2.3.7, Cyanogen Mod 7.2. And now I'm going to show you. Um, we are running 1.2 gigahertz right there. And the end button is the home screen button. And the app drawer opens up pretty quick, closed pretty quick. And I'm going to go ahead and run a quick quadrant test and get back to you when it's done. So I'm coming back right towards the end of the test. And the 3D graphics are pretty good. Uh, I'm sure no one would ever expect that, but... 1.2 gigahertz, this thing's overclocked, it's pretty fast. Should be finishing up right after this. Send benchmarks, yes. And your device is down here. Honestly, not that bad. Uh, for a Barnes and Noble Nook tablet, it's definitely comparable to everything else not slow at all I used to have the Samsung Nexus S but now I have my device and it's a uh, final score is 21 21 so we're going back to the home screen as you can see the live papers well uh, live wallpapers work just fine and let's play a quick game gold miner and you probably notice these buttons up here and those come built in with the ROM see I'm on level 17 it's pretty snappy 3D graphics are looking pretty good you get to see them in person to get the best effect so yeah pretty much guys I just wanted to show you the snappiness of the ROM and the sounds make the clicky sounds when you open and close the lock screen uh... as you can see i have a bunch of games on here you can download them all all of them in the marketplace and um... so pretty much if you want a tutorial on how to get your barnes and noble nook color running on android i'll be happy to make a video if you guys just message me and let me know you want it i'll show you step by step I definitely think this worth this tablet is worth uh it's probably around hundred fifty dollars now and it's definitely beats paying five hundred dollars so um that's it for me right now. please comment rate and subscribe for future videos. Thank you.